If you don't want to miss a minute of those epic events in your life, like your kid kicking the winning goal in footy, or maybe making a home run in softball, or maybe making the match-winning try in rugby, then you're gonna to wanna to get on board GoPro's awesome feature, which is called Hindsight. Hindsight is a feature where your camera starts recording for up to 30 seconds before you press the shutter button. It's a great feature, it's really simple to use, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how. So once you turn it on, make sure it's on the video mode, and then we're gonna select this oblong down the bottom here, so we're gonna press that. Now it's gonna bring up all your other video options that we have available, like standard, activity, but I prefer cinematic, so I'm gonna keep it on that one. And then right next to my option, I'm gonna press the pencil. Now the pencil is gonna bring up your cinematic menu, or gonna bring up the menu. And on this second row here, you can see how it says hindsight, and it currently has the setting of off. So we're gonna press on that. So there's three settings to hindsight. There's, fifth, there's, uh, there's off, which is the current setting. There's 15 seconds, which is the middle one. And then the top one, which is what we're gonna to choose today, is 30 seconds. Okay, so now we're going back to our main screen here, the main back screen. And you'll see just above my finger, it has like a little gray oblong, and it's actually counting um, numbers there at the moment. It's actually currently counting up to the hindsight time that we've selected, which in this case is 30 seconds. If it was 15 seconds, you would see it counting up to 15. And in a moment, that's going to turn blue. And once it's turned blue, it's mean that you currently have the full 30 seconds available for you in hindsight. If you press it before that oblong bit turns blue, what that means is that when you press the shutter, you will only have that amount of time as your hindsight footage. So for example, if it's uh, still counting up to 30 seconds in my situation, and I had have pressed it when it was 17 seconds, it means that I would only have 17 seconds worth of hindsight footage once the shutter is pressed. Now I want you to watch that little blue box the moment I press the shutter, like so. Aha, uh -huh. so you can see now it's recording, so it's starting to record, but it hasn't started recording from zero seconds, it started recording from 30 seconds, because that's how much footage is currently in the can, so to speak, once we've pressed the shutter. So when you've grabbed that uh, special moment and you've finished recording, you just gotta press this button here to stop it, to turn it off. All right, so if you listen very carefully, you can hear me mumbling away there in the background, talking long before I press the shutter. And uh, really, hindsight is such a super feature, and it's so awesome that it's been included on the GoPro Hero 9 and the Hero 10. You want to make sure you've turned the beeps option off from your GoPro. Otherwise, when you do press the record button, you will hear that almighty beep that uh, indicates the start of your footage, and it can be highly annoying uh, when you are playing back the footage later on. So to make sure it's turned off, we want to swipe down from the top of the screen like so. And this is the option here for the beeps. It has the musical note on it. We're just going to press on that. It says beeps off. Another thing to consider is that because the camera is basically always pre-recording uh, your footage, it is going to go through batteries quicker. So make sure you have uh, a spare battery, good to go, or maybe a couple, uh, especially if you're going to be shooting all day. If hindsight is something that you plan to use on a regular basis, a good tip is to add it to your shortcuts on your home screen, and that is super easy to do. So from the home screen, we're gonna press on the uh, oblong at the bottom, find your selection, press the pencil, like so. Scoot all the way down to the bottom, find shortcuts. And so currently my upper left has nothing, so I'm gonna select that one. And now I'm gonna use the slider to scoot up until I find hindsight. All right, there. Ah, finally, okay, so now I've selected hindsight. Just gotta tap back here. You can see how hindsight's been uh, selected there. And now we go back to our main screen. 
So now we've returned to our main screen, you can see our hindsight is uh, highlighted over here. In my case, upper left, and it's highlighted blue. And you can see here up the top, the little uh, oblong is now uh, building itself up to my selected time frame of 30 seconds. So hindsight's there. If you want to save battery power, it's super easy. All you need to do is press that and we turn hindsight off. So hindsight is currently off. And to uh, put it back on again, just got to press that button and you are good to go. Another great GoPro feature that you might want to check out is called Live Burst. And this one allows you to take great still photographs before you press the shutter button. To learn more about it, click on the link over here now. As usual, thanks for watching and until next time, I'll see you later.